Christiane, it's very good that you came here. And uh, well, like it's it's always great to talk to like-minded countries, and in particular Latvia. These days, these uh, tragic uh, moments of history in Ukraine is not only our friend, but also our ally in all sorts of different activities on international arena. And they are extremely important, as everybody knows, to uh, revert back to peace, to stability and security of our region. Uh, underneath, there are lots of other bilateral issues, uh, trade and um, cooperation on many different fields, including digital. But that's, that's obvious, it goes uh, without saying in a very good direction. But I'm very happy to host you here in Warsaw yet again and to be able to exchange our opinions on what's going on now and what about the next couple of months. Thank you for coming. Okay. Uh, thank you, Mateusz. It's uh, always a pleasure to be here in Warsaw. Uh, we are uh, great friends and allies, uh, but I think especially uh, in this time when Russia is waging war in Ukraine, it's important that we put uh, our shoulders together to think of how can we help uh, Ukraine more. So both of us provided uh, weapons uh, even before the start of this uh, outright war uh, last uh, February. Uh, we have been continuing. Uh, we have been urging other uh, allies to do the same, and allies are stepping up. But we have many challenges ahead. Uh, one is munitions. How will Europe be able to produce enough munitions to continue to provide Ukraine, but also to help restock uh, all of Europe? And we also have to think about the future uh, of Ukraine. Uh, we both uh, think it's very important that Ukraine becomes a member of the European Union. I think it's important that formal negotiations start this year, even during the war. And then we have to think what happens uh, when the war ends. And it's very important that Ukraine then become a full member of NATO. Uh, the reason is very simple. Uh, with Ukraine in NATO, Russia would not uh, attack uh, at some point in the future, and we need this for peace and stability in Europe. So Latvia and Poland, I think, are very strongly united in many ways, especially uh, in these days in our support uh, and our vision for the future of Ukraine.